Hi friends, many of you already know that I have more than 50 hydroponic systems from various companies. But my curiosity in exploring all the innovative products in the hydroponic space never stops me there. With that, I just got a new hydroponic system. Well, this is not exactly a complete hydroponic system. This is actually called hydroponics pot. It doesn't come with lights. We will get into the details very soon. To start with the introduction, this is from the company called Botanium. Let's see how it's going to look like and how can we set it up, what are all the things it comes with and eventually how it will turn out to grow the plants. First things first, a user manual. This is the growing medium. This is basically LECA, also known as Hydroton. Here comes the system. A small nutrients bottle. This is 25 ml. An adapter. Finally, the bowl and it has a pump inside it that will circulate the water continuously. Basically, it pumps the water all the way to the grow medium and the water goes back to the bowl. So this creates lot of water momentum and keeps the plant continuously moist. That's it. Looks very cute and extremely different design. This is what made me explore this product. I would say we can grow only one plant in this garden. But anyway, I am going to experiment. Look at the connectivity. There is a pipe here that will pump the water into the upper deck. And this upper deck also has a pipe and that is coming to this ring, water ring. And this ring has all the holes. So water goes into this ring and it will be pumped. We will see it in action pretty soon. But uh, I am just explaining as out of curiosity. Looks very interesting, very simple and nice design wow this looks really nice this comes with usb connection so if you have access to usb outlet you can just use it you don't need to waste the power outlet but it also comes with adapter if you want to use the power outlet you can definitely use this adapter and connect it but i have lots of usb ports available around my hydroponic system so i'm happy to use this directly without the adapter now let's see this in action. I'm going to do a quick wash. All right, now I'm adding water to the bowl. I just realized that there is a see-through window. We can monitor the water level here. I don't see any max level, so I just left a little bit of room at the top. All right, make sure it aligns with the pump. I think this is the only way it fits very well, so we can't go wrong here. Now I'm going to connect this. Wow, look at this. Very interesting, nice little fountain. According to the instruction, the pump runs every three hours so it's going to run a couple of minutes once in every three hours now i'm going to fill the grow medium and place some seeds i'm really excited to see the results this system produces so as a first experiment i want to grow something that comes really fast so i'm picking tortsai for the first experiment in right conditions, I should be able to start harvesting tortsai in three weeks. Let's see how tortsai is going to turn out. I don't know if this grow medium is going to expand. I'm just adding some water to test it.
I don't see any immediate expansion. Not sure if it grows over the period. But anyway, I'm going to stop it here. First, I will add the nutrition. According to the instructions, I need to use five full pipettes for one full water tank. Okay. Shaking it very well. Now five pipettes. That's one. Two. Three. Four. And five. That's it. And I'm adding a four seeds in the center. I'm going to grow only one plant depending on the germination. I will thin out the seedlings and eventually keep only one plant in this pot. This is really small. Definitely thoughts I, I can't grow more than one plant in this. Maybe other plants like lettuce, I can go with a couple of plants and aggressively harvest it. But for thoughts I, one is limit for sure. Now I am going to add a little bit of medium at the top just to cover the seeds a little bit. That's it. Since I need some lights for this pot, I am going to keep it next to my aero garden and see how that's going to make progress. That's a quick introduction to this nice little cute product. I will keep you updated with all the results that are being produced from this hydroponic pot. So please stay tuned and I will keep you posted. Here it is. I'm just keeping it next to another hydroponic system in which I'm growing tot soy. If everything works here, these plants are going to have a new friend. One of the important things I look at when buying any hydroponic system is the availability of accessories and replacement pots and their cost. Sometimes, even though the accessories are available, they could be expensive and I don't want to spend a lot of money on them. When it comes to botanium, two things that came to my mind are nutrients and the grow medium. We will quickly run out of these and need to find the replacement. Starting with the nutrients, I see the availability of nutrients on Amazon, so this doesn't look like an issue. If I don't see it is available or if I feel like it is expensive, I can simply use the aerogarden nutrients. The second thing is the growing medium. This is just clay pebbles and I can see plenty of options on Amazon. I can just go with a bulk order with less price and that lasts for a while. Alright, that is pretty much all about the Botanium Hydroponics pot. It is plain and simple and a nicely designed compact system that can go in any small space. The best use case I can think of with the system is to grow common herbs like basil, cilantro, parsley, mint, etc. I will keep exploring this system and keep you posted. That is all for now. Thanks for watching and happy gardening.